Hey Jammers, it's Dr. Who is my babe, and in today's video, we are going to be going to the Summer Carnival, and I'm going to be showing you guys everything that's in the Summer Carnival, how to play all of the games, because they can be a little bit confusing. This video is going to be a lot of fun, and if you enjoy it, remember to give it a thumbs up, and in the end of the video, there will be a giveaway, so make sure to keep on watching. Okay, so now we are in the Summer Carnival. Over here in the Summer Carnival, this is print and play. You can print out one of these pictures. This is telling you which one is different. This is coloring. There's a little maze. All these options and they are super fun. They are a great way to pass time in the summer and are so enjoyable. Then if we go around here, we can see that there is this cotton candy machine. Now, playing the cotton candy machine, you can pick what kind of cone you want. Right now, I'm going to pick the clean white one. And then you can pick different flavors, like pink, blue, and purple. You get three different choices. I'm going to be showing you guys a special choice where you can get a special phantom cotton candy. So you want to do black at first, and all you have to do is just move your mouse around. Then you do white, just move your mouse around. And then do black. It does not matter what your cone is, just to order these colors, black, white, black. This is yummy, and once it pops up, it's a little phantom, and it matches my little pet too. Now, let's go up here. Now, let's look at these shops first, or at least this shop. This shop that I clicked on and it's loading is the Summer Carnival shop where you can buy different plushies. There's giant plushies and pet plushies. Now, these plushies are super cool. As you can see, $1,500 for the giants and $750 for the smaller ones. There's spiders, monkeys, foxes, um, owls, rabbits, turtles, dolphins, octopi, sharks, and that's about it. These are super fun, and I'm going to show you in my den when we're done with this section. Now, let's finish up the shops. So, over here to the shops. We have this shop and that shop. This shop is the clothing items for your animal. Butterfly wristband, Ferris wheel hat, all of these cool things. I mean, all these cool things. These are cartoon gloves and they remind me of Mickey Mouse. So that is super cool if you want to dress up as Mickey Mouse. There's some railroads, all kinds of summer kind of stuff, and they're super cool. Same options as in a normal shop. This shop is for dead items. Oh, no, thank you. And there's a bunch of candy, cotton candy stuff, lollipop dead items, and all of it is super cool. I personally really like the hot air balloon, so I'm gonna get one of those. Here I have a bunch of tickets. I bought most of these, which I will show you how to buy them in a couple of seconds, and it's super cool. You also mostly earn these from playing games. Now let's go down here. As you can see there's a bunch more games which I will show you all of those. But I'm going to show you one more thing that's not a game and it is right over here. This is how to buy tickets. I bought a bunch of tickets and these tickets are um, half of the price of the tickets equals the gems. So 500 gems for 1,000 tickets, 1,000 gems for 2,000 tickets, and 2,500 gems for 5,000 tickets. I think it is super cool if you have a lot of gems, which I obviously do, and it's very cool to get these summer carnival items by buying these tickets. Now, let's look at the games. The first game that I'm going to show you is right here, Phantom Ball. So it will say something like, five, spend five gems to play. I'm going to click yes. Now, how to play Phantom Ball is that you will get a little ball, wherever it is. Oh, wait, what's happening? Oh, there it goes, it just loaded. So, you will click a spot where you want it to point. The yellow going up is how far the energy. So if it's really low, it will barely move, and if it's really high, then it'll go all the way. So I'm gonna do it pretty high, and click. And it went up and I got 25 points. I'm gonna click towards the center and do the power super high. Oh, I almost got that 250, but I only got 10. Right in the center. Oh, maybe not. Try to get that 100. Oh, I can get to I can get to 25. I can do it. Yes. Oh, I got 50 instead. Let's try to get that 250. And 
Oh, I didn't make it. I should have done a little bit more power. But that's okay, you know? Everyone needs a six. Okay, that 250, come on. Oh, I got the 300 though. Let's try to get the 300 again. What about that? Oh, that didn't work out. But that's how to play Phantom Ball. The next game I'm going to show you is Dunk a Phantom. This game is going to have little slingshots and you're trying to dunk some phantoms, as the title says. Spend five gems to play. Yes, please. Okay, so I'm going to pull back on the slingshot and try to hit the target. And you want to do this as fast as you can in the middle of the target. Ooh, there we go. Now we've got this one over here. Ooh, a little bit too high. What about now? Oh, too low. What about now? Oh, no. I don't know how to do this. See, this game is super hard because in the beginning it shows you where the ball is going, but towards the end it does not. The next game I'm going to show you is Carnival Darts. Carnival Darts is where you're using darts to try to kill these little phantom creatures. Move with the arrow keys. So I'm going to move around my little arrow keys and try to hit these little phantoms. And what about now? Okay, uh. Oh no, I do not want that phantom from towards me. Get away. Oh, here's another one coming. Get away, mister. Oh, two more. Pow, pow. Oh no, they already came. So I'm going to try to get these balloons before I die. And I got a low score. Oh, what's happening? I just figured out if you press the space button after you're playing the game, it'll replay the game. Here we have a little question box. The question box tells you what kinds of games or cards you want. I want a Jolly Ranch, well, Rancher Prize. Whatever. And now the next game is Candy Catch. Speaking of Jolly Ranchers, Candy Catch. You catch candy. So you're moving around this bucket, you're trying to catch these candies and not catch these phantoms. So in very small effort. Yes, I'm getting all of these candies. You especially want to catch the gold ones, because the gold ones give you more points, but you do not want to capture the phantoms, because then they make you get less points if you capture them. So I'm capturing all of the candies I can, out capturing these terrible phantoms. And it's working out pretty well so far. I think I maybe only caught one or two so far. Or zero, that'd be pretty cool. And we're just going to keep on doing this until the game ends, which is in a couple of seconds. So oh, no! The game is about to end. Oh, I just caught a phantom. It's terrible. Okay. And the game is done. And guess what? I got 156 tickets, so not very bad. Gonna click it. No. And let's go up here to this game. I believe this is the last game. And this is Rackable. Rack of Phantom. I forget what it's called. And it's basically whack-a-mole, you try and hit the phantoms, except not the lightning dies. And the gold ones, of course, are worth more. Oh no, I forgot that you're not supposed to hit those. Right at the start of the game. So you don't hit them. Gotta make sure you don't, even if it's super tempting like it was for me. And I am using my touch screen on my little laptop right now. So it's working pretty easy, that's why you cannot see my mouse. Because I'm currently not using one right now. Ooh, I was just about to get him. Okay, this is pretty easy. This is one of my favorite ones because it's pretty easy to get. And I really enjoy it. You can get quite a lot of tickets as well from it. So I would definitely recommend playing this as one of the main games in the carnival. 171 tickets. That's more than the last one. And I won't play again. But well, let's go over here. There's a little fire pit that you could sit with your buddies at. And that is pretty nice and cozy. If we go up here, here's a little bouncy house. You can bounce through and then go out a slide that brings you right towards that whack a phantom game. Now, I think there's more stuff that you could do with this cotton candy machine, so let's try it out. I'm going to show you a couple more combinations. If you grab this yellow star one and you do the same phantom combination, which is black, white, 
and then black once more, you'll get this really cool keen phantom. That's what it looks like. Now if I want to play it again, I'm going to grab this yellow cone, and I'm going to do yellow three times. There it goes. One, two, and three to finish it off. Once I've done that, look at what I get. I get a star cone. Now another one you can do is pick up the heart cone, as you see I did, and do pink three times. You can probably guess what kind of shape we're going to get at the end of it. This, but once you've done three pinks with the heart cone, you're going to get a cute little heart. Another one to do is to pick up the plain cone and pick out white right here, orange, and then yellow. And as you can probably tell with that kind of color combination, you are going to get a little paw. I know, you probably didn't expect it. You probably thought I was going to say candy corn, but no, it's a cute little paw. Another one to do is if you pick up this little blue guy here, and you do a blue, a yellow, and a pink, guess what you'll get? You'll get this super cute rainbow. This one is personally my favorite. I think it looks super cool. Another one you can do is to get a little moon. You do the lightning cone with white, blue, ah, and then white again, and this will give you a cute little moon. Let's wait for it to pop up. There it is, super cool. And if you want to get a little sun, you do the yellow star cone, and then the combination you do is yellow, then orange, and then orange one last time, and we're gonna get a cute little star, I mean sun, sun, and there's a little sun. And that's it for the cotton candies. I think that is super cool. I forgot to show you it in the beginning, but I think all these cotton candy combinations are super cute and you can express your personality through them. So the giveaway at the end of this video is going to be two pairs of rare cowboy boots, two pairs of rare curly wigs, and a rare alphabet. If you want to enter this giveaway to receive all of these items, or some of them, please type into the comments your username, your status, which is member or non-member. I'm not going to discriminate against you if you're a non-member or member. This is just so I know if I can gift it to you or if I have to meet you in game to trade it to you. And tell me what your favorite part about the summer carnival is. Is it the games? What type of cotton candy combination it is? Or something like that. Thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Oh, oh yeah, it's Dr. You. Great! <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Remember to subscribe because I try to make as much content as I possibly can. School is ending for me on June 20th, which I know, very late ending for school. But it's finally ending June 20th and I can make a lot more videos. And if you like the content like this video where I show you around some Carnival, then please subscribe and click that notification bell if you want. Thank you so much and I'll see you later. Bye!